In this video, we'll be doing a basic preventative screening search. Running searches to identify where your screening gaps are is a very simple process with MetaAccess. We will be looking for all our male patients between the ages of 40 and 74 who have not had a lipid profile in five years. For starters, we're going to open up our demographics section. Next, we'll search for all our male patients with an active status. between the ages of 40 and 74. If you're new at running searches, you could go over to the right side now and run an active search. Click on the chevron by searching and click search. This displays a list of patients that meet the criteria. If you click on those patients' names, it brings up their chart. And you could do a sampling of a few charts to make sure your criteria is correct. So in this case, I would check to make sure that the patient is in fact a male with an active status between the ages of 40 and 74. Remember when doing any searches, it's good practice to test your searches as you go and to make sure that and validate the charts to ensure you're getting what you asked for. Next, we're going to go to the observation section as labs come in as observations. I select the category of lab. And enter the observation in the observation field. Remember, you need to call it exactly the same title as how it comes in. Now I know in this particular clinic, LDL is documented in two ways, as LDL and LDL cholesterol. So I'm going to make sure and put both in there. That's done by clicking on this little plus sign beside the observation field. You could potentially have just put in LDL and, and put contains in, but with observations then you run the risk of um, another observation with LDL in the word. So if you know the exact ways they're documented, it's better to do an exact search on the observation itself. Also note that I didn't search for lipid profile. Lipid profile is a title for the test group and not an observation. So what I do um, is, is, is look for one of the observations within the group, which is LDL. Next, I'm going to look five years back, so that'll be 2011. And now the most important piece, I'm going to select this checkbox here beside the observation title, which says not. So basically what I'm asking the system to do is look for all active males between the ages of 40 and 74 who have not had an LDL, LDL cholesterol in the last five years. And then I click on search. Once again, it's a good idea to review, do a sampling of, of some of the charts that it brings up to make sure that in fact the patients that you've got listed have not had an LDL cholesterol done in the last five years. Once you've done that, you can either export your list to Excel, PDF, or print a patient list under type.
if you wanted a, a list of patients that you wanted to contact to come in and get their blood work done or do some other sort of outreach.